What is it guys, it's Violet Telly here and welcome back to Let's Catch a Vibe. Now, I hope everyone's feeling great, feeling amazing, feeling vibey. As you guys can see, I am continuing the item shop switchover. 20 seconds left on the clock. We had a really, really cool skin introduced last night. We had the brand new Firefox skin. We also had a brand new style for the Manic skin. Some really, really cool items returned last night. But what we're going to get tonight in... Wait for it, we still have 7 seconds. Three, two, one, let's go! Now, it will be Wednesday night, taking us into early Thursday morning. Ooh, okay. Looks like we have a brand new emote, the Galaxian, to pretty much join in with the Pac-Man collab. So let's join in and let's have a look at the Galaxian emote. Mission, destroy aliens. Jeez! yo -ho -ho. This is sick! He's just bringing back all those memories, man. Jeez. Galaxian. Ah, oh, that is cold. 300 V-Bucks. Obviously, we have the return of the Pac-Brained um, emote and the Pac-Man bundle. You guys will have seen these uh, when I did cover them when they came out on the channel. Really, really cool. But that emote, though, is amazing. Anyway, moving us to the return of the second half of the featured store. We have some really, really cool skins. Starting us off with the legendary Oppressor. Out of time and out for vengeance. Part of the Domination set, first introduced in OG Season X. As you guys can see, we have two, um, we have two alternates. We have the red default, and then we have the blue alternate, which, I don't know, I'm still stuck on the red, if I'm honest. Still stuck on the red. Love the fact that the skin, if I point out, he's actually got some kill counters on him. So he's got like 10 there. 15, 20, he's got 25, 30, and uh, he's got another 5 there, so 35, we've got some really, really cool kills. Anyway, moving us on to the legendary bat bling, we have the Exo Spine, always carry a spare, looking really, really cool. We do have the default, and then we do have the blue alternate, which looks really, really cool. Moving us on to, away uh, from that, we have the, fat, the Plasmatic Harvester Tool, or Plasmatic Edge. Calibrated for absolute domination. Part of the uh, domination set, looking really cool. Again, we've got the red, and then we've got the blue alternate, which, I don't know. Again, it's just the blue just doesn't look, you know, doesn't pop off like. Anyway, moving on to the last item, we have the angled fire animated wrap, which looks really, really cool. As you guys can see, it's got like a progressive scan wave that goes down the entire weapon. Uh, literally animated all over in a nice little red. Pretty damn cool. Looks very cool on various different weapon models. Ooh, looks good on Sniper. Anyway, moving us to the return of the Brightstorm bundle. Don't really need to cover this because, you know, it's pretty much self-explanatory. It is the Brightstorm bomber. Breezy as a summer's day. She has a good version and a evil version, or a dark version, so we call it. We have the Bat Bling, which is the Gordo, stuffed with Llama Corn style. Again, two styles. We've got the good... And then we've got the dark version. Again, last but not least, with the harvest and tools, we have the breezy bashers. Look out, here they come. We've got the good version, and then we've got the dark version, looking really, really cool. Nice little bundle. I mean, it's a small bundle, but it's a nice, cute little bundle. You get a harvest and tool, a skin, and a battling. Moving us to the return of the Celeste skin. Serving cosmic justice on the battlefield. Part of the Scar, sorry, ooh, can't pronounce my words. Part of the Star Skirmish set, first introduced in Chapter Two, Season Seven. Always loved the fact that like her um, her bands on her. Oh my God, I can't. I just can't pronounce my words tonight. Anyway, love the fact that we have like animated um, stars on her bonds there. Really, really cool. Love the fact that we've got like a star skin as well. Moving us onto her bat bling, we have the Spectral Star. Make your wish part of the star skirmish set love the fact that we get a bit of animation there on the like zip tag on her bag got like a nice little rainbow we get some stars sparkling moving us to the harvesting tool we have the prisma blade a truly stellar weapon and an absolute badass um design for a guitar who would want a guitar that's designed like this like this is absolutely 
absolutely badass. Again, similar to the tag on the bag, we get a rainbow that's animated on the harvesting tool with some nice little twinkle stars there. Moving us under the step, uh, moving us under the moving us under the return of the daily store. <laughs> hey, I never said I could speak English, okay? Anyway, we have the return of the daily store. We have the return of the dawn skin. A dash of celestial sass. Part of the celestial phase set, first introduced in chapter three, season one. Really, really cool. We have a daytime skin or a day skin, and then we have a night skin, which looks absolutely amazing. Really, really cosmic. Love the fact that you can actually um, change these. Um, I don't think they're reactive to like day and night. I just know that you can just change the styles when you want. Uh, love the fact that we get like some effects on the shoes on the day one, where we get like a bit of like a bit of a rainbow effect as well. Really, really cool. Absolutely bright. Moving us onto the beam bag. A dazzling dream of Skyward Brilliance. Again, absolutely love the effect on the dark version of the bag and the bright version of the bag. Really, really cool. You get that like vibrancy from the sun. Anyway, moving us onto the return of the match point skin. Funny enough, I was actually watching Wimbledon earlier. Really, really good match on. Anyway, we've got the match point skin. Serving with skill. First introduced in OG Season 9, looking very, very cool. I like it. Last but not least, we have the emote section of the Daily Store. We also have two wraps, a bat bling, and of course, a Icon Series emote. The Smeeze. Hop to it. First introduced in Chapter 2, Season 4, the Marvel Season. Moving us on to the return of the Sunsprout bat bling. Perfectly sunny. Part of the Fatal Fielders set, first introduced in OG Season 8. Looking pretty damn cute, if I do say so myself. Moving us on to the last two items, we have two wraps. We have the Fan Art. Looking really, really cool. As you guys can see, it's more like a beach um, theme in the background. Love the fact that we get the Coddle Team Leader and Fish Sticks. Really, really cool. First introduced last season, in Chapter 3, Season 2. Perfect for the um, summer, this is perfect. Oh, I love that. Anyway, moving us on to the last but not least item in the daily store, we have the Zend Out. You guys can't see, it's some koi fish. You know what, I never actually realized till a year ago how expensive koi fish are. Oh my God, these can reach some bread. That's all I'm gonna say, they can reach some money. Anyway, in terms of this, it is quite cheap. Looking really, really cool. Loving the kind of like, I want to say kind of orange bronze-ish um, metallic features that we have. Absolutely amazing though. I do like it. It's just it's just a lot. Like you're probably better off getting a magic carb and trying to evolve it into a Gyarados rather than trying to pay for an actual coin carb. Like it's just nuts. Anyway, moving us on to the return of the more offers. You guys will recognize this skin that we had introduced brand new last night, the Firefox skin. He does come with a glow style and a different helmet as well. So anyway, we've got the Firefox skin, face the threat head on. So he has default, he has a second alternate with the helmet, and then he has the glow version, which looks <laughs> absolutely amazing. Moving away from this, we have the Fire Fangs Bat Bling, really, really cool. We also have an alternate style for the Manic skin that got introduced last night as well. Everyone that would have had this skin already, already owned it, would have had it gifted it to him in the previous, um, like during the day. Anyway, enough of me talking gibberish. Moving us on to the return of a few bundles that we had introduced over the last couple of days, and some we may have had introduced last night. So we have the return of the Ryu and Chun-Li bundle. We have the Sakura and Blanca bundle, which we've had for over at least three or four days now. Really, really cool though. Last but not least, we have the Kami and Guile bundle. Looking really, really cool. And then we have the, or still have, the Naruto rivals. We have Itachi, or a, you have Itachi um, and Ultramaru. We have Ga and Hinata. Pretty damn cool. Um, I actually learned how to pronounce that name now. It's Itachi Uchi, 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 Uchiha, Uchina. I don't know. I can't pronounce anything on camera. I just sound absolutely weird. On camera, I'm absolutely fine. But on camera, I'm absolutely terrible. Anyway, moving us on to the return of various different items as well. We also have the return of the OG Naruto bundles. Really, really cool. I recommend grabbing the Sasuke and Sakura. Just because, you know, everyone's going to buy the Naruto and Kakashi one. But if you like them, I'd say buy it. Anyway, moving us on to the last few items now. I would definitely recommend grabbing this glider because it does come with an exclusive loading screen. 
But yeah, some really, really cool items. I did manage to buy the Spider-Man Zero bundle because I've just been paid from work. So obviously I had to grab this before it disappeared. But yeah, guys, pretty much nice and quick to the point. We've had a really, really cool item shop. Can't take away from the fact that we have a brand new animated um, emo, which is the Galaxian. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Give that a nice 15 kisses. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did enjoy this video, don't forget to smash the like button. If you didn't enjoy the video, let me know in the comments down below why you didn't like the video. Also, are you old enough to remember Galaxian? Are you not old enough to remember Galaxian? Let me know in the comments down below. But anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, if you are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you're new and join Team Let's Catch a Vibe. Also, if you are new, please don't forget to push the bell notifications to get notified as soon as that load. But more importantly, don't forget to stay vibey and I'll catch you all vibing. Peace!